John Adams presents Web Business Masterclass from Conception to Perfection. Hi, thank you for watching the video. This is in fact John Adams. I am going to show you the truth about what it really means to build a successful website business. Now understand this before we start. There is a massive difference between building a website and building a web business. Anybody can take a free template. Anybody can get a blog put them together and create themselves a website. All you need is a domain name, a hosting account and a platform, in this case the WordPress blog. That doesn't give you the right to attract people into your website. It doesn't give you the right to be able to make money. You know it is true to say that you could build a website and you could give away gold on that website and nobody would ever find you. The only person that would ever look at your website would be you and your mum, and your dad, and your brother, your sister, and your girlfriend, or your wife, or your husband, or whatever. Nobody is ever going to find you, just because you've built a website. You see, this is the biggest mistake that people make, and this is where the gurus, or the so-called gurus, suck you in to spending money. This is where the web designers make loads of money. This is where the webmasters suck loads and loads of money from you. This is where you're going to waste all your money. This is where you're going to do all the shiny objects, where you're going to buy all the PDFs, where you're going to waste all your money buying what is supposed to be all that you need to build a website. Most of it is crap. Most of it is put out there just to make you spend money. Most of it is there just to make you go round and around in circles. You see, it's not just about the graphics. It's not just about the website. It's not just about the content. It is a combination of a lot of things. And here's one of the biggest faults that people make. Using free templates from people that you don't even know. You have no idea if it's been coded correctly. You have no idea if the structure is correct. When the robots from Google come in, they will have a field day if they do not like what they see. So probably one of the best lessons I can teach you right from the beginning is don't take the free ride all the time. Don't think that if you put enough free things together, it's going to make your business successful. Let me ask you a question. Have you ever seen a successful business say that they built that business for free? Is there any craftsman, any skilled person out there that tells you that he runs his business for free? It's impossible. Okay, you have to understand that you need to invest properly if you're going to build a website business. Now this is me getting on my high horse and whenever we do a little video together I'm always going to start on my high horse. I want you to understand that I'm not here to give you what you think you want to hear. I'm here to tell you what I know you need to hear. So understand this straight away. There are certain rules that have to be followed before you can build a website. There are certain steps that you have to take before you can take that website and turn it into a web business. When people arrive at your website, there are certain skills that you need to put in place if you want those people to click through and spend money with you. You have to understand that there are certain steps that you need to take. It's very, very important. Now, there are actually seven elements for internet success. They are seven bits of a puzzle that you need to put together. Once you put those together, things will start to happen. Once you understand what each part of those elements do, then you will start to see success. Then you'll start to get that light bulb moment inside your head that tells you something. So let me tell you the truth behind a successful website business before I end this quick introduction video. The business offline is not the same as business online. There are many, many differences. And I'm going to try and cover every single aspect of the differences as we go through this free training course that I'm putting together for you. But let me give you the basics. In the off world, business success is all about location, location, location. You see this every time you go into your shopping centers or into the malls. Where the shop is positioned in the street or which part of the street will determine how successful those businesses become.
It's as simple as that. You can have a shop in the right place with not even a lot of effort put into that shop and you can make a great deal of money. You can have a shop that is absolutely awesome but is in the wrong part of the street or in the wrong street and it's going to bomb. It is not going to attract people. It is not going to take money. And that is the way the off-world works. Here's a great business model. When McDonald's puts a business, a shop, into a shopping area or into a mall on a particular part of the street, the other burger shops, they are going to make sure that they are as close to that McDonald's shop as they possibly can get. Why? Because of location. Because McDonald's have done their homework. Because McDonald's know that it's not just about having a shop in a street. It's about having that in the right street, in the right part of the street, on the right side of the street. So remember that. On the internet, the rules are completely different. We only have one long street. There isn't any better place to be on that street. What needs to happen is your positioning. So on the internet, we turn that location into information. So success on the internet is about information, information, information. It's knowing where to put that information. It's knowing how to get that information out there. It's knowing what kind of information that you need to become successful. If you can get that right, if you can provide the right information to the right people in the right manner, structured the right way, then you can become successful. It doesn't matter if you started online with one dollar or whether you've come online with a million dollars. If you do not get your information correct, you cannot make money. You cannot keep the search engines happy. You cannot keep the visitor happy. So remember that. Remember that it's all about the structure of the website. It's all about the content of the website. It's about taking the seven elements and putting those elements in place to make your life more successful. So let's end the introduction showing you the seven elements. We've got a niche. We've got keywords. We have a website. We have content, we have traffic, we have pre-sell, and we have search engines. And on the next training video, I'm going to show you where those seven fit in. We're going to cover each one of those seven, and I'm going to show you what it really means to get fast, long-term, real success on the internet. It is much easier than those people out there are telling you. It is far better for you to get educated and to structure your website in the correct manner. This is John Adams signing out. I promise you, you are in for the ride of your life. This is going to be the easiest, the simplest, the most honest and trustworthy way that I can show you to become successful online. So make sure that you look out for the next video. Make sure that you follow all these training videos. If you want to go to the website, there will be a link underneath this video. All you have to do is click that link and you're going to arrive at the website. Web Business Masterclass is going to change the way that you think. Thanks for watching and I'll speak to you very, very soon.